can start now. Yes. Oh, OK, OK, fine. Yes. Good morning and a warm welcome to everyone present in this virtual session. With the blessings of His Holiness, Sri Jagadguru Shivaratri Deshi Kendra Mahaswamiji, we have successfully completed nine sessions of Career Connect in the, from the month July to September in various fields like army, banking, dentistry, adolescence education, and also from artificial intelligence. And children have made the best facilities and the outcomes from this Career Connect. Today, I would like to welcome Dr. Sunil Rao, the guest lecturer for the day, who is with us to enlighten us with this speech on management education. I, myself, Geeta Srinivas, the coordinator of JSS Public School. On behalf of JSS Public School, welcome you, sir. I would also like to welcome our principal, Mrs. Geetika Karola, teachers and my dear students who are there in this virtual connect. I request students to listen to the session carefully. During our session, students will be exposed to various aspects of the world of work during their learning process. Before we start the session, we will seek the blessings from God. Is Ghana in, sir? Yes, ma'am, I'm there. Yes. So over to Ghana for the prayer song. Thank you, ma'am. Gana Pri Devi Karuna Mai Kadambari Amba Katyayani Gana Pri Devi Karuna Mai Hare Valla Bhe Sukhadaini Hare Valla Bhe Sukhadaini Om Kara Ropini Narayani Bhuvaneshwari Jagan Mohini Bhuvaneshwari Amba Jagan Mohini Shri Chakravasini Devi Gauri Gana Pri Devi Karuna Mai Om Shakti Om 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 Thank you, ma'am. Yeah, very nice and very melodious voice, Gana. Thank you for your soothing uh, voice in this uh, pleasant morning. Uh, thank you very much. Okay, over to Anumeha, ma'am. She will be giving the introduction of Dr. Sunil Rao. From today, we have started the Career Connect Parent Series, where parents of our school are so many are very well uh, in all the fields. So one by one, we will be having a, a sessions from our parent side. So today, the first session that is uh, parent series, we have Dr. Sunil Rao, sir. Um, so he will be explaining us about management education. Over to Anumeha, ma'am. Yeah. Thank you, Geeta, ma'am. Yeah. Good morning, everyone. Dr. Sunil Rao, PhD Marketing Management MBA. He is having more than two decades of experience. He has more... He has versatile industry exposure in sales and marketing, franchise management, and in education. Sir is an author, published five books and more than 20 research articles. Sir also backed the Best Educationalist Award and Innovative Leadership Award recently. He has been awarded as a launch specialist. He has also launched many products like Lux Body Wash, Parley Hide and Seek, BSA Hercules, Euro kids and other preschools. Sir has been working as a consultant for educational institution for the quality teaching and accreditation. He is an expert educational services auditor. He led team to get NAC, AICTE, ISRO, RH, and many other accreditation and certificates in many institutions. He has been a business consultant for institutions preschools, and medium and small scale industry. 
Sir has also trained hundreds of entrepreneurs on business aspects. He is an expert in trade marketing and distribution trained several sales team. He is in Tata Crucible Quiz Championship. Sir has won the first prize in national level corporate series. He trained ERP, SAP, Oracle, sales and distribution at national level. Sir also backed Reiki and state level cartoonist certificate. He conducted several faculty development programs and trained thousands of higher education academicians. He worked as a principal in Bangalore University affiliated colleges. He has been an examiner of question paper setter and reviewer for many universities. Currently, Sir is the head of the institution holding a campus in charge position at Amethi Bangalore. On behalf of JSS family, I welcome you, Sir. It's really an honor to have you with us. So please entail, uh, enlighten us with your valuable words. Once again, I welcome you, sir. Over to you, sir. You can take this. Thank you, sir. Good morning, everyone. Uh, thank you for a wonderful introduction and the prayer uh, by Ghana. Uh, before we start, we take the blessings of our uh, Sri Guruji. Uh, JSS Guruji and I also thank the principal, coordinator, teachers for giving this opportunity and the students who are going to stay here for a patient's listening. Okay, so uh, shall I, can I share the screen? I have small things to share. So I hope I can. Yeah. So let me go with I'm not going to uh, make anyone bored, of course, uh, because I was also a student earlier. So uh, definitely I will go fast, we'll finish fast, okay? So hope everyone had a good breakfast before we start. Uh, now, uh, the management education. What is this management? Uh, if I ask you what you want to going to do, what you are going to do, uh, you will say, no, I want to do doctor, I want to be a doctor, I want to become an engineer, I want to become an accountant, right? There are a lot of uh, fields you say, no, I want to be an architect, right? No, I want to be a scientist. Correct. So there are a lot of ambitions we always carry with. Uh, of course, little bit of focus we have already made. Otherwise, we will may plan in future what you want to do. So students who are already in 10th standard and all, they'll be more excited what to do next. Whether shall I take science, which in science, again, there are a lot of combinations or in commerce, there are a lot of combination of it's a arts, what is a combination? Uh, or do I need to do a POC or shall I go for uh, directly some diploma course or any other certification course? So there are a lot of questions we keep always roaming around here and there. But ultimately what happens, we many times we fall prey to the friend's decision. What happens? She is also doing, he is also doing, so I will also do this. No, right? This is what happens. But dear friends, whatever you want to do, you do it. But ultimately, there are certain things you have to polish yourself. Okay, so that is where I'm planning to do today to show you, showcase actually what you can do, even whatever the course, whatever the specialization you are at. Okay, so let us go. Before we start understanding what is management or management education, uh, uh, my first question is, uh, I can uh, pray this right. How to, uh, okay. So before we understand this, so oh, let us try to identify who is a best manager. So most of them, you might have seen now, who is the best manager? My father, my mother, my uncle, my aunt, bank manager, right, general manager, so many positions you might have seen, teachers, right? Who is your best manager? Uh, whom you know? You know anyone? So of course, I don't think it is an interactive session or it, I think they are on mute. If they can uh, unmute and answer, they can unmute and answer, no problem. Uh, it's a it's a wonderful actually. Otherwise, you are the best manager ever without any second thought can say is our mother. Right? So why you know what mother does to you? What mother does to you? She plans a day before your school starts, right? So it is not the day on when your class starts. So 
uh, she will not plan. She will plan a day before. She will procure all the items, whatever the requirement to you, right? Whether it is a, for the breakfast things or it may be for your stationary items, whatever it is. So they do it, right? They organize your bag and box, right? Whether the lunch box is washed, ready, prepared for tomorrow to use it, carry it, how many are there? You will have a short break, long break, everything, right? So usually this, this is what we won't think actually, but they have already planned all these things and ensure your dress is ready, right? So that is also important. No, tomorrow, what dress, which dress? So whether it is a uniform, blue, white, whatever it is, you have a, uh, a combination, right? So this is also they do. And she knows to feed properly, right? She knows what you like and when you have to be fed at, what time and how much quantity I had to put it in your box. So everything mother knows about it. Of course, uh, uh, she sits with you before the next day. She will sit with you and plan the next day. So what time you have to get up, what time you have to start, what is the plan, so everything. Something like she is the best manager in the world, actually, you know, because she plans, she procures sources, and she organizes the things, right? And she uh, uh, controls the things, the day, how it has to be, timings, everything and all. Okay, so this is what it is. Of course, further two does at a different level, at a different section but our parents are the best manager we have come across now okay that's how you can understand the management in nutshell with very easy don't think um, so what is this sir uh, you, you no need to say this after coming to a session you're telling parents are managers so i'll become a parent that's how uh, to do it no even organization requires to do all these things okay so let us see then in a concept level, what is management, okay? So in a concept level, if you want to understand whether it is a science or an art, the question comes, no, sir, I'm studying B, B I want to do BE, BTEC, or BSc, or uh, I want to do uh, arts, commerce, or something. So I don't know what I'm doing to do. So how can I become a management? I'm not going to do any management course. I'm not going to do only things. So there is no PUC, there is nothing option, no option of management. Either way to go to a, there are three, four uh, major categories, right? You have science, commerce, arts. Basically, that is the three stream. And of course, alternative to that, there are a lot of other diplomas and all which comes. But where is management then, sir? So don't ask this. Where is this management all about? Management is neither a science. It is not only an art. It is the art of using the science. Okay? Assume you are conducting a birthday party. So what happens with your birthday party? How you do your birthday party? So first thing, what you will plan? You will plan your food, right? What should be the menu? That's very important. Date, time, menu, and what the return gift or gifts and dress code. So all these things you will plan based on what you will plan. You plan based on the people, that is friends and relatives, right? Whom you are coming in. You will also check how many are confirmed, how many are expected to come. Then you will see your, you calculate your budget and you will see your overall then your family to cooperate with this, right? So this is how your entire planning goes without your knowledge. It is nothing but a management skill actually. It is nothing but a small management. Today, what we are sitting in the uh, session is nothing but a management. They have organized, they have been organizing, no? Students have been given, a meeting has been scheduled, it has been communicated to you, right? There is a communication channel which goes through WhatsApp or through mail or something, and they will coordinate with the, the uh, guest who wanted to address. They coordinate with the teacher who will be addressing, who will be uh, saying the welcome song, all these things. Uh, initially, maybe a dry run will be done and all. So this is the management and they present. So when they present, what happens? If they get the benefit. Who gets the benefit? Student gets the benefit. Ultimately, management talks about what then? It talks about the benefit. So what the objective should be there of benefit. So if the objective is there, then through certain process with some people, okay, people behavior and attitude. So the service, uh, 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 the science and the art of skills and knowledge of the people will be taken process through 
to reach the objective that is the benefit okay so this is actually a small way to understand what is management of order book okay so um, we we keep doing a uh, lot of activities in a day for example you want to go to a movie you plan a day before or you plan a weeks before actually which movie is releasing when right and who are all coming what is the ticket price where to watch when it is going to release have you book who books it right so you are booking it we are going it okay which dress do we have to have any snacks to carry there or we'll go there and what is your plan to have some snacks so after that what everything there is a management hidden okay without that there is nothing happens in the world so let us see what what is this of course i am making increasing your appetite i know but uh, help us it is online i cannot sir Uh, offer you this uh, given opportunity in offline i could have definitely offer you this I don't mind so so you know where you buy this where do you buy all these items i don't get answer or you can put it in chat box uh, i can also see in the chat so in shop okay after now is telling it's in shop we buy this okay a store correct and maybe in the yeah, supermarket we may buy good good market right so let us go to another question like this only okay? be on interactive where do you buy these items so where do you buy these items this also in market online okay we may buy in online because of pandemic we have addicted to grocery stores yes there is a grocery stores swiggy instamart good when wonderful vegetable mart so five vendor right good so we do it in a grocery shop or hopcoms or so many things we do right so next let me go to the next item where do you get, buy these item where can you uh, source these items okay showroom correct so the second one medicine one mg very good very nice yes so uh, yeah so medical shop so let us come to restaurant yeah at dosa a very yummy masala dosa we source it at restaurants that we cannot get it in medical shop right so we have to go in restaurant only right so now my question is here when you buy these items do you buy uh, 100 or 1000 medicines or do you buy 100 cars no no we won't buy 100 cars we buy one car we may buy maximum to maximum prescribed tablets maybe up to some 10 or what it is or one strip or two strips maximum right so this is what vegetables do you buy tons of vegetables no we buy only not even sometime one kg half a kg we buy right so who made these things so why i am telling bringing these situations to understand what exactly the management there are lot of divisions in management i am just going taking a you through a journey in one aspect of the management okay so don't get confused i am not touching others to i make you understand better understand i am taking you to the one set of one line of management aspect here so what is this so this is called distribution management okay so this is called distribution management how they do you cannot buy see for example car they manufacture not 1 2 3 as and when you want correct they manufacture some lakhs of cars right maybe 50000 1 lakh car they manufacture at a time okay so they will not manufacture always a white color car some maybe 1000 with white and 5000 with red another 10000 with blue right so there are a lot of variants again the colors comes sometimes they import certain items we import mobiles and all right they manufacture mobiles and all means they import many of the items for that then it reaches when we go to shop we expect proper when you go to a showroom we expect a car should be polished clean and white color or red color should be there and one blue color and one yellow color whatever it is you won't think the manufacturer will do in lakhs and when we go to a showroom it is all one one we see that okay tablets the manufacturer manufactures in millions the tablets okay not 1 2 3 they manufacture in quantity of millions 
and we get in strips, one strip, two strip, maybe 10 tablet, sometimes two tablets also, four tablets also we buy, right? And see that the chain, how the breakdown happens when you go to a store and when you go to a showroom, that means the, uh, the warehouse. Warehouse means nothing but it's a go down of a manufacturers. So the difference between there to here, there are a lot of breakdown should happen. So there we see a middleman. So middlemen are nothing but maybe a distributor, maybe a wholesaler, or maybe a sales executive, or maybe some agents or brokers who brings from the warehouse to your retail store. I think I'll chat, yeah. So from there to retail store they bring. So what is this retail store? You said showroom, supermarket, bakery, medical stores. So this is where they do it, okay? And not only that, they also do a single unit, right? So, and variant. Sometimes what happens when you go to uh, buy a biscuit, you will say, I want uh, uh, for hide and seek. And there are three, four variants. They will ask uh, what you, which, how many grams or what is the packet? 15 rupees, 20 rupees, 20 rupees, they will ask. No, you say 20 rupees. Okay, you will buy 20 rupees. Then there are the mint flavor, chocolate flavor, coffee flavor, orange flavor, which flavor you want. You will also, okay, I want chocolate flavor. So you'll take. So like this, there are a lot of variants, every product. So manufacturer does all the things, but what you get in your store is what you want actually, right? So they will, the management knows, okay, in Bangalore, in HSR layout, this is what, this product is moving. Let me keep in these stores, this many packets of biscuits or chocolates. They know Cadbury Dairy Milk who buys. They know Cadbury Bubble Dairy Milk who buys. So they keep there. So the market also they manage. So this is what actually the essence of marketing management or the distribution management in precise. Okay. So I will give a in short of this product so that you will understand. Uh, before that, I want one small thing. Have you understood whatever I said or is it not been taken it. Yeah, as per demand, correct. So it, they go as per demand. The speaker is correct. So can you please, anyone can respond to me. Is it able, are you able to understand this concept? Yes, sir. Okay, fine. So let me go ahead. See, now you will see the product, no? For example, single unit you will buy. So how this product, there is another management goes actually. So product management, you see, this is only a distribution management I'm talking. Another one is the product management is also there. Let us see what it is product management. So when you say product, you see quality of the product, type of the product, packaging of the product, variant, okay? For example, one single product comes in different variants, different colors. For example, you want to buy a, a, a T-shirt, okay? When you send T-shirt is there. How many colors are there? You see, there may be some 20, 30, 40 colors in one single type of t-shirt. There are like the 10 types of t-shirts may be there. Every 10 types of t-shirt will have some eight to nine or 10 different colors. And all types, all color will have different size, correct? So this is where it is means the product is not so easy to manage. You should know exactly which uh, SKU we say, of course, it is not no, required for you, uh, uh, stock keeping unit. So which SK, which product is moving in particular shop is very important. So it requires a lot of uh, uh, sensitive uh, information when they sell and buy. That's the reason when you go to shop uh, while billing, you might have seen, they will take your mobile number, right? You are means parents' mobile number, they will collect. And also they will ask, there will be made some of the uh, storerooms, stores, they will have some feedback form. What is your anniversary, when your birthday, so anything and all. So what happens in those days, they can create one more offer to you. Like that price. One is product, I said, different size, different uh, uh, types of t-shirt, different size of t-shirt and different colors of t-shirt. In the same way, for everything, there is a price change whether it is a high price or low price or a competitive price, right? So when they take, collect your information, they will send an SMS. Titan is coming up at the Dasara festival now. Diwali festival started Amazon. There is a 
uh, they already started now Amazon uh, day for uh, big million day in uh, Flipkart, so many things, right? So they do these offers, discount campaign, they run. Why? They want, they know the customers have money and they like this kind of products at particular price. So let me give this offer so that I can get the business and this will be reached. Okay. So this will be reached through online, otherwise sometime offline. So they, they know where, which place they have to, if everything is there, if the product is not available, when you go to next shop, it is waste, correct? You will say, no, that product is not there in the market. Even retailer will say, no, I don't know. It is not come there, right? It may have happened many times. You will go for some particular chewing gum advertisement you see, and you go and ask to the next neighborhood store. They will say it is not there. Then you will forget. Whenever that ad comes, you will say, no, it only they will show it will not come. Right, the negativity starts through so the proper. The management is very important there. If they are not managed all these four things of one product, they will fail. The product will not sustain in the market. Okay, that is the importance of this management in this. Okay, so in our life, I, I hope this you understood the market and the product distribution management, product management. Why I'm bringing this is it is very, very near to us. We do. Yeah, daily, for example, you go to buy chocolates, biscuits, right? Cold drink or whatever it is. So these things, juice and also, these are all very daily usages what we have. That's the reason I brought this uh, connection to you. I hope you understood a little bit about it. So let me take a last my uh, uh, examples, one last set of examples. Uh, then I will say why, what you will get by doing a masters or what you will get by doing management education okay so this is one it is so let me see uh, i hope you have come across several instances okay so that is uh, man ki baat prime minister addressing our nation right so how it happens do the prime minister my prime minister will take the mic okay let me you bring come you video you just uh, take a shoot of uh, one video shoot so that I will address the nation. Will they should do like this? No. There is a setup done. There is a studio setup ready. There is a script ready. There is a facts and figures which has been already analyzed and given to the prime minister a day before. And there is a program set, maybe some 15 days, 20 days before the program starts. And the telecast, they have made everything ready. They have to stop all other programs during the 10 minutes of monkey bath or 15 minutes of monkey bath. So these things are half an hour of monkey bath. So these things are very important. This is called actually management. If they manage well, the program comes well. Okay. You know, this is NDRF. Now uh, we have been seeing surrounding uh, uh, states and other places like Kerala, Karnataka, Uttarakhand, and all they are affected by flood water. It's everywhere flooded. Even Bangalore yesterday night also it was flooded. Right? So who helps us? NDRF. Okay, so uh, this national uh, 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 or, or disaster uh, relief uh, team, what, who are there? So they come everywhere. They'll be deployed and they do. Do you know who does this? Will the military people come and do? Of course, military people saves. Of course, there will be a a uh, naval, naval person who comes there to rescue people from waterlogged places. Of course, there is a uh, pilot who takes the helicopter there, but who takes exact decision to send where to which person, what time, where. This is what done by a management student, management graduate, not student, it's a management graduate. So they will be there to address all these things. So you know, we have recently reached, day before yesterday, we crossed 100 crores, that is 100 crores vaccination. Who did this? Did the doctor went to 100 crore people and vaccinated? No. Did the nurse went everywhere and vaccinated? No. Did our prime minister or the home minister or the uh, health minister went and vaccinated, uh, did the vaccination? No. So who did this? There is a management team. Those team are having the graduation of BBA, MBA, who did having a science background or may not be having a science background, they know how to distribute these vaccines, what time it comes, what should be the temperature kept. Those things will be given by the doctors and nurses. And 
the managing of them, coordinating with them and reaching the things and making this report analysis. Every day we see switch on the news, we say it is increased, decreased, this is the COVID thing. Every way we see, you know, this is the management people who did this. It is not the doctor's duty to analyze, okay, yesterday 300, today 350. No, it is not the doctor to do it. It is doctor is only to treat the uh, uh, patients. Nurses are only to take care of the patients. They are not here to see, okay, I did 10, tomorrow I'm going to do 11. No, they are not going to do this. They will only keep how many patients are coming. They are going to do this, finish. They will say, this is your duty. This is what you have to do. This much you have to do it. So who does this? Who tells the nurse? The management graduates who does that? Tells them, okay? Next, if you come. How many of you know? I hope everyone knows. Super Dancer, KBC, right? So uh, the Sony uh, and uh, TV. So the, who does this activities? Who does this events? Is the Shilpa Shetty and all they do? Right? Dada and Shilpa Shetty and who are the Gita Madam? So do they go and organize this pro program? Or who does this? Is the Sony TV head who is sitting, who is owning the uh, channel? We'll go to, okay, you come, you dance, you'll say, no. Then who does this? There is again a management graduate who does organize all these things. They know, okay, at this time, who has to be hosting, who has to be uh, 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 the, the chief guest for this program. Okay, they know if I bring this chief guest, my TRP will rise. TRP is nothing but the rate of viewers will be rising. Okay, and they will also see who has to come at what time, what color, what dress, everything they will say. Of course, the dance performer will, who perform the dance will have their own choice. But other than that, the theme will be given by the management people. Okay, today, this is the theme. This is the world. Some, uh, uh, so, uh, what do we have? Super Dancer, we have KBC. Of course, KBC, you see, every day, the Amita Bachchan will come with a different color suit and all. I used to always watch. What is this? Where you think he is wearing all these things from his wardrobe? No, it is given by the management people. They will say, okay, this is the background we are putting. So this is the color you had to have. And this is the thing. And he will be getting all the instructions to say, he will say, okay, let us take the break. No, he, but not by his wish, he will say. Or he will say, oh, enough, we talk. So let us start with the game. No, he, everything will be displayed to him. So he will be just doing the action, whatever he, the instructions he gets. So that is the management student, the scope of the management students. Okay. And you think, uh, who who gives you the newspaper every day? The same day newspaper comes at five o'clock, six o'clock to home, right? So it is on the same day. So what time they will print? How you get? There will be a hawker, right? So who? A hawker, cycle hawker who comes and delivers to your home. So what time he delivers? By five o'clock, six o'clock, whatever the time. So then what time he'll be getting that newspaper? He'll be getting somewhere in the morning, four o'clock, right? And for four o'clock, the entire area from where they'll be getting from the distribution point means the printing press. So what time they will do it then 12 o'clock midnight. So they know if I had to reach in Bangalore at five o'clock, I had to supply my vehicle should start at 12 o'clock midnight. Or if it has to go to Mysore, so I cannot reach Mysore at the same time as in Bangalore. So what they will do, they will first load the vehicle for Mysore vehicle with the newspaper at 11 o'clock or 10 o'clock. Same way, they will have everywhere printing press. Then how the news will be printed? Yesterday night happened, same thing will come to us. Yesterday evening it happened, it comes to us. So there is many editor, reporter will be there. They will be giving you the, they will send you the, uh, they will send the uh, information to the editors. Editors will keep certain columns ready for it. So that flash news kind of thing. So whenever it comes, immediately they will print and they will start printing it and it will be sent. So fast they work, you know? So this is nothing but a management students who does this. And to be frank, not only this, uh, as I said, the doctors perform the operations in OT, right? You're saying it is not the doctor will decide everything. Doctor will decide which kind of operation to be done for this uh, 
and how it has to be done, they will take care of it professionally. But exactly who decides for this upper patient from uh, uh, this background, this patient has admitted for this problem and doctor has suggested this has to be operated. And what, when it has to be operated, management will decide how, what should be the price, right? They will give the, uh, they, they give the, usually the uh, one package when you go to, and anybody goes to hospital. They say this is the package, this is the operation. If anyone has the heart attack, so they say this is the angioplasty, angiogram they have to do. So this is the package, five lakh, six lakh, something. So depending on the profile of the customer, the, the patient, they decide these packages. It is not the doctor going to do anything there. Doctor only perform for them. Doctor, all patients are same. There is no difference in that. But the difference who makes is the management students. They know how to make this business, how, how, how many days we have to keep this particular patient and uh, how much affordability they have. Do they have insurance? They don't have insurance. If they don't have insurance, when they have to discharge. So everything, these management students, sorry, graduates will take care of this. Okay, and we are amazed always to go to, uh, what is this, Wonderla? You remember? How many of you have been there? Hope all have been there. Hmm? So what we know, we go there, we enjoy and come back. Away. This is the ultimate. And what we get, the satisfaction, happiness we get. Correct, we enjoy. So who made this? The behind the screen, it is not the people who are engineer who constructed that uh, the joint wheel or whatever it is. The, the, it is not only the engineer who created that waves need to operate. The management people are the key ensuring the happiness has been delivered to a particular customer who visited their visitors. So that is where the management to graduates comes there. They know, you will we'll not be knowing, no, you just go and uh, jump into the water and we start enjoying waves, everything, right? But management, management people, the graduates, where they will be ensuring there should be a trained swimmer around you, surrounded, guarded by this. There'll be a watchman will be watching every time any undo, undo, undo in, uh, or towards incident happens or not they'll be always on you means we'll be on always guard it's very safe there so who ensures this it is the management graduate who ensures this it is not the engineer who prepared the who manufactured this or who the engineer who or the uh, the scientist who has made this okay this is the way this this should be the force of course this is required who manufactured it but they'll not be there to see that you get the happiness by this this only by the people this only by the management graduates who can do this. And also this, before deciding the place, okay, where I can do this kind of amusement park? Can I do it in Bangalore? Can I do it in Mysore? Can I do it in Tungpur? So they know the, which place is right for them and where to place. In Bangalore, why can't they do it on MG Road then? If so good. No, there should be a proper water resource. They should be enforced by law. Permission should be there. Correct, and it should have a particular number of areas, acres, so that it should not harm other people, right? And they should also balance how much ever the forest they have taken away from uh, setting up the amusement park, the same amount of or the next level of amount has to be restored in the geography. Otherwise, they will not be allowed to operate. So it means that eco balance, we say that eco balance has to happen there. Now also even Metro we are seeing, no? So they give permission, they are given no permission for a second uh, stage of Metro to operate, to cut certain trees in Bangalore, but they have to plant the saplings up uh, in uh, given areas. So they have been assigned certain areas to do more plantation. The same way, if you see uh, the international programs, Olympics, okay? So Olympics is international program. How it has been done? It is not been done only by the uh, organizers. It's not done only by the uh, sports person. Of course, sports person are there, they are the key. Right? But beyond it, 
who was there there is a management fellow who not only one a team so who organized everything okay this is the time table the schedule how many services you might have seen the team how they were helping the sports people there so they, they should be medi uh, medical assistance should be given so there should be a proper ticket management that to travel abroad and all to manage the covid norms so everywhere this has been managed by the management graduate okay not only this we have zoo when you visit, visit zoo app what happens there we say animals so can you put some animals in some cage and can you say it is a zoo no other we will not get any viewers also to see or animals may not sir survive there so zoo is again of course there is a science or biology to take care of the health of the uh, uh, the animals but in the same case way there should be a management people who will take care ensure the proper health of the animals have been taken proper hygiene has been maintained in the park and proper food has been provided proper medication has been provided to the uh, uh, this uh, animals and from where the animals are coming they, all the zoo many of the zoo have uh, uh, many animals shifted from different countries right and they should they should know what kind of environment they can survive so they have to create that kind of survive environment for them so in the same way the when the visitor passes through they should know how the safe it has to be safeguarded and how the animals also to be safeguarded by the uh, people who disturb so all these things they manage and security should be there everywhere right so the timings they have to manage and if it is more number of uh, visitors they will stop at certain level because animals will be afraid the sound the uh, uh, it should there should not be much of disturbance for the animals so all these things will be managed by this management students of course these management students are not the ordinary students i will tell you why so this is what i have gone through this management who have done this management courses not only this some uh, event uh, or some uh, or, you know, instances we have come across there are a lot of companies we have seen i don't know much you are aware of this but for your information i have put it's not necessary for you uh, like wipro you might have heard infosys you might have heard airtel you might have heard right uh, uh, so these are all the companies apple of course you might have heard so these are the companies all the ceos have done management course that's why they are not able to manage well okay so uh, so in the next level i can take you much more interesting things in fact so we usually there is when you say management course what is this management course there is two course one is mba another one is bba okay at graduate level after puc you can do bba and afterwards there is a master level mba there are a lot of pgtm also there where i am gives pgtm where uh, uh, the other institution give pg pm and pgtms right the ima gives pgtm again there are a lot of courses are there all are same equivalent okay so we have different specialization so to monitor zoo it is not necessary to have a finance management so there is there is not required not only that is required we may require in future if it is more revenues coming otherwise where what, different kind of management we can get specialized in like marketing human resource international business aviation management hospital hospitality management okay where the hotels restaurants we say tourism packages we see so operations management digital marketing okay so then entrepreneurship right so this is also one specialization in management actually next business analytics sports management there i have seen many of the students coming enrolling for i want to pursue i have to start my own sports company so academy so let me have sports management of course there is a lot of sports management today where we visit decathlon or uh, where you see some academies sports academies and all no they are all again the management people have come across there the olympics there are a lot of sports management people have been hired to conduct all these things okay then how it goes am i boring you is it boring can anyone if you say i will stop here because this is where i am going to tell you in two slides not more than that 
I'm not going to take much. It may take five minutes. Yeah, Bamish. Ola, correct. Yes, correct. I, I, I agree. It is chain. It is chain. No, no, sir. Okay. Interesting. Fine. Thank you. So this is what I wanted. Uh, at least I have not made anyone boost. Most of them. So how MBA boost your career? Okay. Since we don't have that much of interaction here, I'm only just uh, telling you the words. So it gives a better career opportunities. A student who did, who studied BTEC in electronics, electrical, or computer science, or whatever it is, what they get, they get a technical job, right? Where their level of technical job will be, means the pay, pay scale will be less. Whereas, means they have to go in particular industry only. For example, if I am a BTEC in electronic company, electronic field, so electronics. So I had to only apply for electronics company. I cannot apply in some Apple company, correct? Or some other companies which is dealing with electrical or mechanical or civil, right? This is what happens. But when you do MBA after BTEC, what happens? The opportunity is the scope increases. You can apply here also, you can apply engineering company, you can apply commerce company, you can apply even in a zoo also, no problem. Even you can apply in an amusement park. There is an electronic division which is to be maintained, right? So that scope increases there. And it is worldwide recognition of its credentials. The MBA is one such course where worldwide recognized. If you even in India, if somebody says, I did I did BE, they say. Somebody says, no, I did BTEC. And somebody says, I did uh, engineering in Bachelor of Engineering. So, so many words they use. There are so many nomenclature we say, right? But when they move to another state itself, what is BTEC is good or BE is good? Some people will ask this question. It is not, it is same actually, one and the same nomenclature changes. But when you say MBA, worldwide it is only one MBA. There is no other alternative for them. So that kind of credentials they have, they know what they have learned in MBA. And MBA is a personality development. I believe it or not, you are still young. You have a lot of energy. As then when you pass on doing certain studies and all, you will become more and more serious. Afterwards, what happens? Some people will stop talking to be, uh, others, strangers in law. So, but when you do MBA, it will open up. Again, you will start a social life. Very, very important in that. You know how to manage, how to interact with people. It's a personality will be built. Like the ex-servicemen, you may it's not ex, you who are in the military. They, you know what their personality is. So disciplined personality they carry, right? The police, so disciplined they are. So the same kind of personalities here also, management wise they carry. How they carry, I'm going to do next. They'll have a high put salary potential. Of course, professional skills will be increased. How the professional skills will be increased? For everything they can do a chart and they can present it and they can do it. So that's the management all about, okay? So increased self-confidence. I'll come back to this personal development, personal development later or personal development how it works. So the increased self-confidence will be there. So who does MBA? They know they're not worried about. Okay, I can do something, nothing to worry about. I can survive, I can sustain, I can make some people who are with me also survive safely. So this is what the management is and it has a credibility. And because long run, well, the MBA is from how many years and it's going to be how many years. and you will have a strategic thinking. I don't know how many of are aware about this word strategic thinking. Of course, your parents, you can ask. Parents definitely help you in what is this strategic thinking all about. So you will be able to think, okay, can I go abroad and settle or I have to go study here only or shall I do a business? So these are all kind of things, strategic thinking. Okay, let me do business. I'm not worried about what this or some are there. Uh, I will not do a regular schooling. I will go to... Uh, 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 occasional learning. I don't want this. So this is a strategic change they do. The in, entire thing they will change and they have different goals there. Okay. So that is what a management graduate will have. Self-discipline, as I said earlier. So better time management. Right. You see your school, the time as per prescribed time, we are doing it. 
now if i cross 12 o'clock you will say sir you have said uh, better time management you have only crossed your time so i don't take it don't worry so go get your attitude will be there so ultimately how your personal development happens again i am insisting certain last slide is this so uh, i'm not to worry about it entire mba or management is all about the birds view okay a chartered account chartered accountant knows what is the correct balance sheet whether this balance sheet has been prepared properly or not but a finance manager or the finance management who, who is a management graduate they know whether is it helpful for me or not with this balance kind of balance sheet do i need to increase the capacity of the balance sheet means the revenue has to be increased or revenue has to be decreased that they will see they have a birds view with their company how to finance the company or so company i will speak with the company owner i will say okay what do you want to do i want to do a 100 million business okay now what is going over 10 million okay so another 90 900 million from where i'll bring okay let us bring from here so this is the source i can go for public fund i can go for uh, uh, capital venturist so all these things are done by this management students graduates get updated you see any of the management graduate they'll be updated what is market going on what is economy going on what uh, prime minister addressed day before yesterday or yesterday sorry yesterday what prime minister addressed at 10 o'clock many of the students will not be knowing it but management student you ask they will be knowing it okay it is none of their business but still they know it everyone is not a finance manager but even the hr management student or the hr manager knows what is Uh, the market going on since x whether it cross 60000 61000 coming down coming up everything so they will get updated with respect to the market mba is a personality by itself because it deals with people okay you know if i tell this if i assign this task to x person how i may expect the return or the work done so they will see have the foresight of thinking what may happen next okay that is the beauty of this management course profit oriented i am telling it is not a profit only it is a benefit oriented you can take okay when it comes to organization it is a profit oriented when it comes to a personal life we can talk benefit oriented whether do you have a benefit by doing this okay so managing things you can do manage okay time up that that's what telling now so Uh, so balancing business office home like juggling so you know how to juggle the entire thing so this is called management okay so uh, i hope uh, i have uh, given the insight of course i couldn't since i couldn't interact i'm not aware much uh, how much you were uh, into involved in this and all so you can put in the chat or you can ask question and answer if the mic is provided to you or to on switch on do you have any questions do you have any questions yeah what is ca course chartered accountant ca is chartered accountant uh usually uh Uh, who has to be in specialized in chartered for example if you want to declare a company's uh, balance sheet it has to be done only by chartered accountant only he is authorized to sign the balance sheet is uh, correct okay the uh, all the ledger profit and loss account has been maintained properly only the chartered accountant get signed if i do a management course what job i am i more likely to get which job suit me more okay so if you want to do a management course what job i am more likely to get is kind through what kind of specialization you are that matters here for example some student do bba and mba right so then they can get in the scope is wider so you can manage as i said you can go to a hospital management you can go to a, a amusement park also you can go to a company for uh, management in this management i said there are some specialization based on that your distance also like i want to be in finance and hr 
or I want to take a marketing and finance or marketing or in production or operations or something. So depending on your specialization, you can, sorry, you can get into those kind of uh, uh, industry or the uh, verticals there you, you definitely which which would be suiting me more you, uh, you usually it suits like your uh, personal uh, personality okay so there will be a SWOT analysis or there will be a small analysis will be done before you taking any course or anything for example MBA uh, there will be orientation course will be done for so because this orientation is very very important usually what happens people skip this orientation session bridge course and all this is the basic mistake what a management student when they join they do they will not be understanding what they have to do because in the orientation they will be oriented on if you do if you take marketing what happens for example a btech student comes we will give an orientation on okay there is a finance if a student who does finance this is the opportunity this is the pay scale this is where the companies has been hired and they will think okay let me take finance or shall i take um, operations guys so that i'll take operations then also we give operations which kind of operation they'll be done but what happens the selection time your mentor or the teachers will be there they will guide you properly which one is better okay be depending on your interest most of the b tech or b students have taken finance and they excelled it is we always think if when a b student or b tech students takes around we have every time every year 20 percent of the b students comes here we think, okay, they may take operations. So we have given a business analytics operation, so many things, information technology and all. But those are the students not taking this. They are taking finance. They are taking marketing. They are excelling in that. So it depends on the personality, the combination of personality. I have, I, I am not uh, showing, I am not able to show because I have done one research paper I have, which the, how the were final uh, uh, decision making happens for the specialization. It is a funnel structure, we say. So that will be that. So, sir, what is Sensex? It is a market or it is an index of market uh, where the uh, share market, we say, no? You might have heard share market is going up. Um, uh, means Airtel has come up with the right share, uh, right issues. IPOs, they have come. So, the Zomato has come up for IPO. So, this is actually a share market at your level. I don't want to make you confused with so many words. Uh, uh, this is a share market. Just understand every company, public companies, public company limited companies, they will have re registered, they have acquired. For example, you have a company of manufacturing one small chocolate. Okay. So you will get profit. You say, yeah, I'm growing now. After five years, you can approach the government node and you can take NSDL approval to go public fund because, sir, I know I can manufacture some uh, one, 1 million or 10 million of million of chocolates. Now I want to plan, I'm planning to manufacture them 1000 million so that I can get more money. For this, you, I don't have money. So can I take public fund? Yes, they say. So you will offer, initial public offer will be given with the permission. So uh, SEBI uh, has to give permission. So once the permission has been given, then they will, uh, they can collect money from every uh, shareholder and they can use this money to operate it and they can get the business and they get the profit and they share the profit to the public. So this is how, uh, and this will be the SEBI what man monitors, no? If the shareholders and all, no? This is what the sense is, the share price will be there, okay? At face value and all that. Of course, I will not take, that is a different session if you want to take. Uh, 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 if you want, actually you can contact through later. I will definitely help you in that, just making you understand about it later. What is the correct time based on our age and maturity? Should we incline towards management course in our academic journey? Management course, you are already inclined. You no need to be separately inclined, uh, Mr. because uh, uh, management course is something like that. I told you, you know, if you want to plan your birthday, how you plan, you know, okay, uh, my birthday is next month. What you do? Okay, you will tell your friends, boss, my birthday is coming. So we will plan in this. This is the game we'll play. Okay, this is where we will go. Okay, we'll take one round and come back. Okay, so many activities we plan. Okay, you will tell your mother, I want this is on my birthday. You will tell your father, I want this kind of gift. You will tell your brother, sister, I want gift. This. So you will arrange, organize yourself to make yourself happy. This is nothing but a management course. So this has to be replicated in 
organized way in an organization. That's all is required. Okay, so you are already inclined, means people are already inclined towards it. Only thing what we need is a professional knowledge is required. You do any course degree or PUC, anything, do well so that score well because management requires 50% uh, means uh, MBA and all requires minimum 50%. Some of the good institutions, they will not take even if it is 50%. They take only 80%, 90%. You heard, no, D, uh, uh, DU, uh, Delhi University. What is the cutoff rate? 100%, right? So the competition is very high. So you have to just score now on your whatever you study, just plan your scoring high, nothing else. Don't worry about anything. Automatically your management skill will be developed. Okay, that is also a management. Okay, I have a goal. This is my uh, 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 goal. I said no in the management in the initially I told one slide. So this is my goal. So how to reach the goal process and how it had to be done. I had to change my attitude, behavior, and what are the skill set and knowledge I had to acquire this. This is also a management. Okay, so management course to support organization. Kapriya. What is the correct based on age? Okay, correct. So any anyone else? Any other questions? Okay, so uh, I, I stop my uh, sharing here now. So if you still have any questions, you can come back to me and uh, through Madam also you can ask. So Madam will convey and I'll convey the message. I say thanks for the uh, patience hearing. Thank you, Madam, for the opportunity given here. And the principal, the coordinators, teachers, parents. Yes, uh, uh, thank you very much, sir. It was a very wonderful session. And hope all our children have understood very well. And uh, just one example, like uh, children, when we go to hotel, we admire and we appreciate the taste, isn't it? Behind that, how many people will have worked, you have to think. Because once when you open a hotel, the hygienic, the cleanliness, and the taste, or because they don't want to lose their customers, isn't it? So people behind that. So there's a hotel management where you will have a separate chef who tastes the food and uh, he tells the taste, isn't it? So regarding this, there are a lot of branches. Sir has come out with a lot of information. Actually, this uh, is a very vast area where you cannot finish off it within one hour. But at least overall, the bird view nicely you have given, sir. It was very interesting. And to sum up, I would like to tell what is management education offers all the necessary tools to equip one with the necessary technique of successfully handling various business and management related issues. Besides providing the basic management cap capabilities, it also provides the ability to use the contingency approach for solving business problems. This is how we can sum up. And um, thank you very much, sir, for taking out time from your busy schedule to give a lecture on this management, business management. It was totally very informative. And also, I thank you once again uh, for uh, sparing time with us this one hour. And we all enjoyed it. It was like one uh, getting inside into the management field and coming out. So it was very impressive and very nice. I would thank also you. like to thank our principal ma'am for staging this useful session. And also la last but not the least, I would also like to thank the children who had participated. And uh, most of them were very interestingly asking questions. So if there are any questions, if you just drop down your mail address, uh, I will tell the children to send their questions and queries to you, sir. Uh, sure. Okay. Yeah. Thank you very thank much, you. sir. Thank and you. Yeah. Thank you very much. Have a happy week.